The main aim of any analysis is to gain a better understanding of performance. The Naxport timeline is an interactive environment containing various tools for diving deeper into the analysis and uncovering insights into the game. The timeline can be opened from the My Analysis section of the main menu or after registering actions from this icon in the toolbar. The timeline is separated into two parts. On the right, we have the timeline itself. Each row represents a category from the button template used for the analysis. The left column contains a list of all the clips you've made during the analysis in chronological order, whilst the second column shows the descriptors associated with each clip. Clicking on any of these clips will play in the video player to view individual moments during a game. Here, you can not only see what descriptors are associated with each clip, but also when and in which order they were added. You can filter the information by choosing to display all the clips from a selected category only, or every category together. Change the size of any area by dragging the sides of the column. Icons in the lower left allow you to change how you view the timeline. You can hide any section or just show the timeline. Hovering over any clip displays a text box containing all the associated descriptors. Again, this is an easy way to see what's happening in each clip. Change the duration of a clip by dragging either end to lengthen or shorten it as required. Move a clip from one row to another by holding shift and dragging it to the desired place. Working with multiple timelines across a number of videos is easy. These drop-down menus indicate the name of the video and the analysis you're currently working on. Depending on the Naxport license you have, you can open combinations of timelines and videos with the plus icon. To move between timelines, click the drop-down menu and select which to open. If multiple people have worked independently on the same video, you can merge each separate analysis into a single file. Right click on the timeline and select Merge the same analysis of the same video to this analysis. This is a great option for combining the work of multiple people working on different aspects of the game, such as attack or defense, into one timeline. The timeline profile allows you to choose which tools and icons to display. This means that coaches and analysts can customise the timeline to suit their own workflows. The profile manager allows you to create and edit profiles or delete the selected profile. To create a profile, click this icon. A window opens showing all the tools available in your version of Naxport. Select the options that interest you most and drag them to the boxes at the bottom to create your profile. You can also add spaces and dividing lines to help organize the toolbar. The profile manager allows you to personalize each different timeline profile. Here, you can also choose between one of the six timeline styles. Being able to create multiple profiles means that people with different working processes can work together, switching between different tools or a simplified view of the timeline. Each profile can be unique to each individual user. Let's take a look at some of the main tools for visualizing data and compiling clips into presentations. Here, we're going to provide an overview of the main tools for painting a picture of performance and getting more in-depth with your analysis. These are the Data Matrix, Dashboard, Graphic Descriptors and Presentation. We highly recommend taking a look at the description for further details on how to fully harness the power of each. Clicking this icon opens the Data Matrix. A table opens showing the complete relationship between your categories and descriptors. The matrix basically shows you in which category descriptors appear. Clicking on the number in the cell plays the associated clip. 
The dashboard is one of the most powerful tools in MaxPort for creating custom visualization, which provides a statistical overview of your analysis. Dashboards are also interactive and linked directly to your video clips. Click here to open a dashboard or create one from scratch. Load a dashboard and click on any chart, graph or label to open the associated videos. Another powerful Naxport tool is the Graphic Descriptor. It allows you to see where events happen on the field and understand why they happen. Create heat maps, check the used surface area, or search by location to get a different perspective on your analysis. The Matrix, Dashboard, and Graphic Descriptor are all powerful tools which help you unlock insights into your team's performance. But one of the main goals of Maxport is to make it easy for coaches and analysts to build up collections of clips which can be used to feed back to the team. The presentation window lets you create lists of clips which can be used to deliver your insights to the team. You can easily add images and animations to maximize the impact of your presentation. It's easy to filter and search using the timeline. The colored boxes here mirror those of your category buttons and rows. By clicking on the boxes, we can hide or unhide category rows in the timeline based on their color. Great for coaches who may only wish to see attacking plays, for example. You can search by descriptor or text notes to help you get to the relevant info quickly. Search through the video clips using your coaching notes or specific descriptors to review your clips. Other filtering tools available in the timeline include data patterns, the descriptor calculator, and category frequency graphs. We highly recommend taking a look at the description for further details on how to fully harness the power of each. You can add notes, descriptors, and change the length of clips with the register properties window, which is opened using this icon. There are more tools available in this settings menu. Go to the timeline section and you'll find different options for ordering and hiding categories and descriptors. In the timeline, you'll also find various options for importing and exporting your data. You can upload data and video to a sharing account directly from the timeline. Click the sharing icon and select the relevant options for sharing resources with coaches and players. You can also export your analysis data in PDF, XML and CSV formats. This is ideal for combining your work with other big data handling platforms. You can compare clips directly from the timeline. Using this tool allows you to simultaneously display up to eight different clips. You can even import an external video to compare with your own clips. This is a great tool for examining technique or for comparing training ground scenarios to matches. Set the start time and watch all the clips back simultaneously. And that's it. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And to keep up to date with all the latest Naxport news, why not subscribe to the channel? Thanks, and see you next time.